Hi everyone, it's Whitney. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing how I seal my diamond painting keychains. You are going to need a paper towel. If you don't have a mat or something you want to work on, just a paper towel is fine. A toothpick, a paintbrush that you don't really care about. And these were cheap. I got them from Hobby Lobby for like 99 cent pack of five. And I used the Tombow Aqua Glue. Got it from Amazon, two or three bucks. No, three or four bucks. Now I did seal this one already. And I love this glue because it doesn't take away the shine from the diamonds. It still looks the same. To me, it looks the same. So, yeah. But I noticed with this, I have to use a either a, a very thick, 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 thick layer of glue or a thin layer of glue twice. Like do one thin layer, let it dry and do another thin layer because when I did one layer on here, these diamonds were still moving, but now they're not moving at all. So I'm really happy about that. But I just hate too that you have to seal like both sides because that's like double the work, but it's fine. But these diamonds are good. They're not going to go anywhere. So this one is already sealed. And I have two here that I'm going to also put glue on. These both, I've done one layer already. This one, the diamonds in the back are not moving, but the diamonds up here at the top are. So I'm going to have to like be very forceful and put more glue there. And this one, the diamonds are just moving everywhere. So I'm just going to have to redo this one. This one I have out because if you have those special gems too, be aware that you cannot. And I am saying this, you cannot because I did it and already and I made a mistake. Take the glue and just run it across the gems. No, go around them because if you go on top of them, you're going to mess your keychains up. I've already messed something up. So that's just for that but paper towel go ahead and i'm going to go ahead and glue this one and fix what i've messed up well i didn't mess up anything i just need to get more glue up at this top part right here and this glue like i just wish i could get it where i could buy like a big bulk of it because that just doesn't seem like a lot like i have about 79 of these um keychains that I need to seal and I just don't you know feel like having to seal all of them with a small amount of glue because I don't want to run out of glue because that nothing annoys me more than running out of glue or something when I'm in the middle of an important project that I really want to finish nothing annoys me more than that so like I said be careful around those special gems because they will get messed up if you are not careful. But yeah, I just needed to seal this top part up here because the back part's already sealed good, so I don't need to worry about that. But I'm going to take this and let it dry off to the side. And these ones are my favorite to seal because you can just take this and just rub the glue all across and you don't have nothing to worry about. But you want to make sure you put a very thick layer on here just like that that kind of looks satisfying a little bit okay and this toothpick is there if you need it because I kind of like using it because I don't want the glue getting on my hands everywhere so that is just how that goes and I have a big old pile of keychains over here that I'm going to be sealing today because I just want to get them sealed because I got more coming in the mail and I don't want it to do those and then I'm having like four or five hundred keychains that's too much and also with this glue too I noticed it does not take long to dry last night I was gluing some of these and they were surprisingly the glue like dried quick even even after I did two layers on that minion keychain it dried really quick so yeah but I love this glue 
and it dries clear as you can see like in that minion one so yep so there we go and we are going to leave this alone and let this dry I'm actually being very cautious to around these corners because that's on that watermelon one where it did not like where the diamonds were still moving so I want to be very cautious with that but there you have it that is how I seal my diamond painting keychains and thank you guys for watching and I will see you in my next video bye